Hey everybody, welcome back to Let's Play The Binding of Isaac. Afterbirth, I'm Nye. We finally have unlocked Inc uh, Lilith. Who starts with Incubus and the Cambion Conception. Which I believe is, uh, that might be what stops you from seeing. Like, stops you from shooting normally. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and go with just a hard mode Lilith. And play her finally. Outside of, uh... Outside of uh, Daily Challenge, because the only time I've gotten to play as this character was actually in the Daily Challenge. So Lilith, as far as I understand, uh, her big thing is that she she get, uh, gets an Incubus. That's the guy who's falling behind me. Uh, his tiers are exactly what my tiers would be if I had tiers. Any tier enhancing item I get, he gets. Um, she can't shoot her own tiers, uh, so that's one downside. Uh, and then she gets the Box of Friends, which says every four rooms I can double up. Uh, my allies, uh, you know, make basically uh, an extra set of friends, double my entire follower setup for one room. Um, good, like great stuff. I'm uh, actually looking forward to hopefully having a really good uh, companion run. Unfortunately, getting that item, um, that's a really weird room. Getting Crystal Ball is kind of unfortunate because Crystal Ball is number one a space bar item, and Lilith really requires that one space bar item. It really sucks. That I, yeah, wow. I hate this room. I hate, like, this room is Lilith sucks. Um, I think this room as anybody would suck, but as Lilith especially. Um, oh, what was I saying? Crystal Ball gives you vision of the entire floor, so you know where all the rooms are. Uh, also has a chance of either dropping a card for you, or giving you a spirit heart. Um, you know, good item, but the thing is, we're Lilith. We need to have this box of friends. It's kind of the entire thing she works on. Wow, I wish I had a bomb. But the game has not seen fit to give me a single bomb on a, a, a floor that's all about bombs, explosions, fires, so on and so forth. Oh, thank you. Okay, so there's not really much of a choice here. Uh, we have to do this. Okay, I was going to say, if that... Uh, slider had stopped me from getting uh, this Polyphemus. Okay, so you, now you'll notice that uh, this thing fires uh, long shots like that. Um, okay, this is what we're going to do. We're going to go in here. Okay, I did not do what I wanted it to. That's fine, though. Where was that other... I saw a tinted rock somewhere around here. The question is, do I want to do the Tinted Rock, or do I want to blow up my way into the Secret Room? Both of which are valid options. I think the Tinted... Well, now it's in the Secret Room. Yep. Exactly what I was hoping for, actually. So, what does Polyphemus do? Well, it causes us to shoot a lot slower. As you can see, my uh, Incubus buddy is shooting a lot slower than he previously was. But in return, his damage has been upped, and uh, it recalculate, recalculates uh, the way damage works. Um, I can't remember what this is. Mom's box, what does it do? Okay, that's fine. Um, I'll speak that up. It recalculates the way damage works. So if you would, let's say, uh, we're going to double up right now. If you fire a shot at an enemy and the shot has uh, the shot deals like like let's say 10 damage and the enemy has 5 health, normal shots just break upon hitting their enemies. On the other hand, with um Polyphemus, it keeps on calculating however much damage is left over and keeps shooting it. It's pretty nice that way. So as you can see, I have two incubi. We're gonna move on. Good floor. Now what I don't know is exactly what Binkies does. I I think it gives you, um, I think you just some extra health and it makes you smaller and I think that may be about it. There's possibly some extra hidden effects that it does that I'm not sure of. And uh, the uh, child's leash that we have just keeps my um, familiar a lot closer to me than he normally would be, which uh, I'm a fan of. Yeah, I'd like to see what's in here. I wish I had bombs. So thankfully, uh, the child's leash is helping me a ton. I really wish I had bombs. Child's leash is helping a ton. Um, yeah, we'll go back and get that. 
bombs are a major issue right now. Still doing pretty good, though. If we can get some bombs, we'll be in a good way. Our damage is pretty incredible. Also need some keys. We, we're we're, we're, we're kind of hurting for consumables in general here. So what I'm going to do is... Uh, I'm going to go in here into this boss trap room. I, I, I would love to go in this boss trap room, but the game is kind of seeing fit to not let me. And we're going to bomb those in an effort to get... Basically exactly what we just got a bunch of money a bunch of key or a key um, stuff like that Okay, we're gonna do this because my my uh, speed is really low and I don't want to die to this boss or take more Damage to this boss we do want a deal with the devil if we can possibly get it and uh, looks like we should be able to get it on this floor Hopefully using my uh, box there was not a bad idea We do have enough bombs that I should be able to get into there. This bomb may even do it by itself. It did. Lovely. Small rock's gonna give me a damage upgrade. Okay, we do want to see all the stuff we possibly can as this character. Now, I don't know exactly what sticky bombs do. I don't know if they drop spiders or uh, what their exact purpose is. I'm assuming they drop, uh, like, slowing fields on the ground. That's annoying, and it's going to do it again, too. Okay, double key. That's great. Uh, our, I don't know if we're going to be able to get a um, another charge on our own, unfortunately. What do we got here? That's amazing. Okay, uh, I'm not going to be able to get a charge out of this room. I'm going to go ahead and just grab another one of these. Two of hearts is not going to help me. We could get a charge. It's possible. I know I'm wasting a little bit of time. I'm just trying to... Uh, we're, the problem is we're running so slow. This could be a hush run by itself. But the problem is it's our actual slow movement speed that's going to hurt us more than anything right now. Because our damage is actually pretty good. Oh, hello. Ah, the D7. Like, no... I'm really tied by by this character. You can only do so much with her. Like, come on. I already have slow enough movement speed and you do this. I need speed now. Like, speed is definitely going to be my thing. I wish I had flight. Flight would be amazing. Let's see what we got. We got little horn. Uh, this should be a pretty easy fight, all told. That early polyphemus really uh, finalized this run. Go ahead and grab the magic scab, come in here, fight Krampus, apparently. I was really hoping for some way to fly. Okay, can you, like, stop moving this much, please? Okay, so we're gonna get a lump of coal. Gonna get some good stuff here. What's this? Two of diamonds, awesome. Judgment is pretty darn good, and I will fight him, or fight him. I will do this real quick. I was really hoping to get uh, Dark Judgment, to be honest with you. Can you give me some good stuff, please? Glad that we got another battery, and the money is good. Come on. Pay out. You've been given, like, 18 cents here. He's not going to pay out, and that's really obnoxious. Really obnoxious. I gave him a lot of money. Okay, that's, that's fine. Doesn't matter. Okay, I do need to move a lot faster than I am right now in order to get um, boss rush and stuff like that. I say as I go into a really slow room. Curse of Darkness is annoying, but not bad. This room is irritating. I hate these enemies. Most because I always end up having to dodge, like, to the side, and that's when they hit me. That's what, that's when they're, that's how they're, they're designed to hit you. Okay. I am so glad that we had enough damage to do that. Sackhead is amazing. Okay. What's in here? Worth. Oh, damn it.
Yeah, generally any red chest is going to be worth fighting in uh, one of these rooms. Unfortunately, we lost all of our spirit hearts already. Just by silly damage from me. I'm hoping for like a speed up from some enemy or something like that, or flight. Something that would make me move a little bit faster. Because again, that slow movement speed is going to be my main problem right now. I don't actually need more health. I do not need the flush. Do not need distant admiration. Come on, do something good. Definitely do not need that. Do not need the mirror. Um, I will take a follower. I'll take Robo Baby. Um, come on. Okay, that's good. Guppy's head. Give me some flies. Is great. Part one of the Guppy transformation is complete. Um, come on, you. Okay, we're just gonna drop this right here while we're waiting to actually hit him. There we go. And that is pretty much why we uh, we did that for basically that exact reason. Death, death. Oh, we'll go ahead and just take death. Pop that real quick. A couple of these guys remain. That's fine. Okay. Some more enemies down here and off to the side. No money, unfortunately, so going to the shop would basically be a wasted effort. Okay, would you stop getting the opposite side of these rocks for me, please? Annoying. Could have guessed this would have been a corner. I didn't, but I could have. A smarter player would have. These sacks are amazing. Got another rules card. Time's of the essence. It's, it's a reminder about, uh, actually, specifically, um, speed runs. Boss traps. Okay, this should be the direction of the boss. I'm hoping it is. Awesome. Uh, I'll spend two keys for this, sure. Didn't quite get what I wanted out of it. There's a chance that we could get another uh, deal to devil here. Not an incredibly high chance, but there is a chance. I'll take all the damage on my way in, sure. Uh, deal with the angel instead, because I didn't take a deal with the devil the first time. I will 100% take the miter without question, and then we will go ahead and uh, fight the angel himself. Unfortunately, I do not have uh, my box of fun available for this fight. I really need to take out these purple, fi uh, purple fires. Okay, now those are done. I did get a spirit heart out of it, so that wasn't exactly a wasted effort. And I now don't uh, no longer have that to deal with. He's going to take a long time, but, you know, I might not be able to fight a ton of stuff, but I might be able to get a Mega Satan run going. And if I could get some of the more amazing things, like the crown, for example, or uh, Sacred Heart, or uh, Godhead on this run, I would be a really happy person. We're going to go ahead and take our key piece, too. Um, not much else that I really want to do on this floor, and given my slow movement speed, I think I'm just going to move on down. Kind of want to go to that shop that was, a, that was actually on my mind, but... Um, didn't seem worth it. With multiple keys in our disposal, the double key room does seem worth it. What's this? Burkano. Let's get our way in here. Uh, I'm not sure that was actually worth it, to be honest with you. Did get some money out of it, though. Keep in mind that a key is generally worth about th three to five cents, depending on the shop. So, getting less than three to five cents uh, per key is not exactly the best business transaction. Okay, what is this? Speed up, please. Lock up. Not bad. So I'm more likely to have drops after rooms, which is always nice. That could have hurt me. I'm amazed that it didn't. But yeah, more likely to have drops after rooms. Uh, chess specifically would be amazing drops after rooms to be getting. This room typically has an item in it. Okay, it just has a chest this time, but that's fine. Problem is, we don't have any way to get to it. We have no uh, flight capability. We don't have the ladder, as rare of an item as that is to get nowadays. What's in here? The moon. Let's go ahead and pop it right now. Speed me up just a little bit, maybe? No? Probably shouldn't have hit that. Okay, let's make our way out. So that didn't speed me up at all. I was kind of thinking that it may get me to move a little bit further away from the room I was in, but not a big deal. 
Okay, so now what we're looking for is our shop, our item room. Just basically trying to get us a little bit closer to our exit here. Because we're not doing incredibly badly time-wise. It's our, our movement speed is the, big, is the big thing that we're waiting on. Our damage is pretty incredible. So I'd love to go to the shop and get some sort of mapping, some way to see uh, where to find the exit so I can move faster. Got another one of these rooms. I don't really mind it, it's just, it's, you're, I'm more likely to take damage on these rooms. What's in here? Per throw, so I'm going to get to re-roll an item. Might use that on a deal with the angel, perhaps. Stain is not going to be too much trouble, I don't think. It's fine, do this, that's cool. It's actually probably one of the best things for me. PJ's is just going to give me a bunch of spirit hearts, which is pleasant, but uh, didn't give me the deal with the angel I was hoping for. There is the exact set of room, rooms I'm looking for, and then as soon as I do that, I can probably leave this floor. Not a huge fan of this room layout, to be honest with you. Especially in this, when I'm not in really 100% in control of my own shots. Okay, get that. Pick up that. We don't know what... Oh, nope. Give me that. Thank you. I found pills. Oh, well. Okay. Five minutes to get to boss rush. Doable. Um, we're just going to per throw that. I will totally pick up Loki's horns because it's an interesting synergy that I find cute. I don't know if it actually works. We'll find out. Even more options would have been fantastic in that previous room. It's kind of a shame it didn't activate. Or, I, I didn't come in here first, is what I really mean. What's this? Joker card? Doing it. Deal with the angel, giving me another uh, baby. And this time, I do have a uh, reroll handy. Or, not a reroll, but a um, thing handy. Charge. So, I'm not 100% sure what those, what the new baby does, but I believe it's just it fires stuff, and that is about it. That's about the extent of what it does. But it is an additional baby. Uh, it does seem... Am I still firing? It does seem to be a little bit at odds with the Incubus I started with, though. Did you notice? No, it's, just, it's on top of it. Okay, I still have both, but they're on top of one another. Makes sense. Okay, Necropolis 1 with 4 minutes left. Not bad. I will totally take Technology Laser Tears. And now we shoot a lot more tears. So, kind of, I, I keep the damage upgrade of uh, Polyphemus, but the uh, other bonus doesn't matter anymore because we just have piercing shots in general. Which is kind of nice. Um... It's a little bit of a damage downgrade, so there is that. Can you keep on moving down, please? Appreciate it. Thanks. Okay, we have no money for the shop, unfortunately. And our attack rate is pretty low, but our damage is really high, so, you know. There's some good stuff here. Justice. Okay, I would really appreciate... A movement speed buff from something. Anything. I don't really care what. Okay, we're just going to do this. I don't want to take damage in this room. I think I have a... Oh, come on. I walked right into that one. Give me that bomb. I've got a charge in here. That's great. Probably not going to make boss rush. I'm, just, I'm, just, I'm too damn slow is the problem. That one movement speed down really kind of hurt me here. It looks like, from what I'm able to tell, uh, I do want the, mom, the child leash, thank you. From what it looks like, the shots off the uh, the angel fetus are uh, homing. Maybe light homing, but it's homing. Damn it. That was stupid damage. No idea what that is, and I'm pretty happy with my child's leash, so I'm going to keep going. That may be, that the leash may also be what is causing the, um, uh, 
angel feet is to sit on top of the incubus, though I imagine there's probably something else going on there as well. Can you guys shoot him, please? Shoot, 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 shoot. Come on, keep going, keep going. Thank you. Want to avoid the damage there. Okay, we're going to pop this real quick just so I can speed up this room a little bit. Try to avoid taking the damage off of all of these guys. It's in here. Um, I will take Headless Baby, definitely. Just giving me another familiar. This one just leaves creep on the floor behind me. Not the most entertaining familiar. And uh, I don't think he's going to get much out of being doubled up. But, man, being on a really thin room, being really slow, and having these enemies is not exactly fun. Okay, I need one cent to be able to make this room worth it, and it's not even worth it for me to be in here, in fact. So we're not making speed run, I can tell you that right now, unless I get somehow a um, Emperor card after getting down to the next floor, which I find incredibly unlikely. God, where's my boss? Incredibly long floor here. Come on. Ah. Yeah, there was not really any dodging that. I'm hoping this is the direction of the boss. This feels, yeah. This feels like a boss corridor. Our health's a little bit lower than I would appreciate. Okay. Okay, yep. Bloat. Yes, yes, yes. Bloat, bloat, bloat. Okay. Didn't take red hard damage. Might still get a deal. I didn't, but I did get a pentagram, which is not only going to up the damage of my followers, but it's also going to make it so I'm more likely to get deals. I still can't go into there. That's annoying. High Priestess card is okay. Um, so speed's not really too much of an issue anymore because because I was unable to make that particular speed uh speed thing I'm probably unlikely to make any other speed run therefore probably not likely to make the hush either if I'm gonna be honest with myself I'm gonna you know really think about it and honestly and it well that was stupid of me if I die right now I'm gonna be really upset with myself what's in here no I do want a little bit of health. Health would be nice. Okay. That little bit of health is going to help. Uh, I could go into that boss room now, and I'm considering it. Wow, that enemy me took a lot of damage. Awesome. Uh, I think this is pretty obvious. A little Gertie. Now we have another familiar. This is, just, you know, make it a familiar run. You know, go with the strength of your character. If your, if your character's good at running with familiars, why run anything else, you know? Holy crap. Stars I don't really care about. I mean, I could use it on the next floor, I guess, but it doesn't seem all that important to me. I would have rather had, like, a hermit or something. Emperor would be nice. Not gonna go in there. There's nothing in there worth my time, I don't think. And unfortunately, the little, the, the mini Gertie is just, it's not worth letting up my fire from my other guys to use it, for the most part. Okay, that was really stupid. Do not take damage in this room. Okay, this I'm gonna pop just for the sake of, like, getting this done quickly. Because I am actually mildly worried about dying here. Mildly. But, you know, dying is a thing that could happen. This room does not seem... Well, the only thing it's worth is blowing that up and blowing that up. Which did basically exactly what I wanted. Gave me a spirit heart, gave me a regular heart, so I'm less likely to die. So Dink Depths 2, so this Stars card is not really going to do all that much for me.
I can't even see where this enemy is right now. Man, I wish I could get that. Okay, this should not be too bad of a room. Especially given what type of hands they are. They're regular mom hands. We got some time, um, considering the fact that we're not going for speedrun any longer, because there's... I just... I wouldn't be able to get there fast enough. So, uh, it sucks that I have to do this room. And yet, it's amazing that I somehow did it and didn't take damage. There's a chariot. I kind of prefer that over the stars, to be honest with you. Okay, so we got a lot of money and really nothing to do with it. I've done basically all that I care to do on this floor. So we're just going to leave. We're going to hope for a deal. We already have both key pieces. We don't need another one. There's no point to find the angels any longer. Our damage is pretty good. Did not get a deal. We'll uh, we'll go ahead and go for a Polaroid win for a chest win. I think it's pretty likely we'll get it as long as I stop taking stupid damage. Uh, it would be a lot easier to stop taking stupid damage if I wasn't walking so slow. So I'm hoping for like a speed up pill or something soon. I'm not going to blame that for all of my damage, but I will say that a fair amount of the damage I've taken has been entirely due to the fact that I do, did get that slow pill and have not gotten any form of speed up, which is weird because Isaac loves its speed ups. And I, I prefer the items I have. Uh, that item just says that if I use, like, a pill or something like that, there's a chance I'll get it back. But it's like, no, I'll just take my... I'll, I'll keep my chariot card. Thank you. Come on. Okay, that's not bad. Just give me more health. Remember, on these floors, I take a full heart of damage as opposed to a half heart of damage. From any random enemy that might choose to hurt me. How amazing that guy took two shots out of the mini Gertie and didn't die. That's kind of incredible. God damn it. God damn it. Polycephalus is such a pain. And taking two hearts worth of damage to him is unfortunate. Okay, oh, come on. I need to remember that I have familiars and I need to stop firing. Okay. Yes, I know. I have the chariot. I know. Um, but I could go for the hush. I have four minutes. Let's see what's going on over here. Speed up. Thank you. Oh, thank you. It's not a ton, but it's it's noticeable. Believe me, it's noticeable. If I could get another one of those, I'd be a very happy camper. Uh, I do not think that going inside of there is going to be a thing that's going to happen. Unless I somehow get a uh, heart or something in this room. And even then, unlikely. See, my guys can do that, too. Hmm. Probably should not have used my uh, charge there, but you know what? Why not? Still trying to still trying to get to the boss of this of this floor. And, um, okay, this kind of sucks. Paralysis, great. Yeah, I, um, hmm. You know what? Screw it. Why not? Emperor? Emperor? Damn it.
If they had been the Emperor, we would have been able to pull something off, but, uh, no. So we're probably not going to see the Hush on this, on this run. I don't even know if I'm strong enough to beat the Hush, and I'm certainly not fast enough to dodge his bullshit. So... Long oh, floor. This is not a... This is Euro 1. Feels like an XL4. Holy crap, there's more enemies. Another one over here? There's another one over here. There's my boss. No reason I should have taken that damage. That was really poor damage to take. Come on. I do not want the matchstick. Thank you. Okay. Well. Mama Gertie. Uh, this is going to suck not having any ability to fly whatsoever. But apparently Mama Gertie decides she just wants to die. Tears and shot speed up are both fantastic. And unfortunately my... Um, well, not my final angel, but one of my final angels did not decide to give me uh, something amazing. Was really hoping for either the crown or for um, uh, whatever that other item is. There, everybody really likes. Okay, I hate this room. Oh come on! I really hate this room. Emperor. Justice. So many chances. So many chances to get awesome. The game just says no. Okay, come on. Hey, get hit. Thank you. That's wonderful and all, but can I get something better than that? Could be the boss right here. It isn't, but it could have been. Boss. Damn it. Like, if I get to the boss right now, there's still a chance I could win. Like, there's still a chance I could get to the blue womb if I find the boss, like, right now. Mostly looking for health here. Boss, come on! Another one of those times, like, I could totally make it if the game would just show me the boss, but I just have the longest boss routes in history. And I'm just going to take damage. That's fine. And no boss. Okay, that's fine. Okay, so we're not going to be uh we're not going to be seeing the blue womb, unfortunately. So what we're going to do instead is we're going to work on uh getting as many positives as possible. We're going to take a few more uh minutes than I had originally intended. Um, to make sure that I have the best possible chance of winning. Because I have kind of thrown a little bit more at the wall than usual in order to try to get this. That said, this room does not hold any appeal to me. There's nothing in it that I want. Um, I'm glad I didn't go this way. Chariot and the Hanged Man. I think I'm going to take the Hanged Man. Invincibility off Chariot's nice, but I can't shoot while I'm using it. The Hanged Man, on the other hand, allows me to fly, get some stuff, and also, well, allows me to do this, for example. Technically, the Chariot would have done the same thing, but... Yeah, boss was still quite a ways away. Well, I got answers for the next floor. What was this? The moon? Not bad. I'm more likely to want to actually complete uh, the floor now that we're not trying to go quickly. I mean, an extra bit of rotten meat's pretty good. Let's see what's in here. Ultra greed. Who turns out to go down by a like, set of something or others? I don't know. I'm running out of uh, running out of talk. Death, hermit, hermit, hermit. Okay. Let's try over here. 
Chariot. Chariot. A lot of the same item over and over and over. I was really hoping for like a um, Joker card or something. I'm going to go all the way to the left real quick. Okay. Well, our damage is really good, so I imagine a d I, I imagine the Mega Satan fight is not going to be too bad for us. So I'm, I'm not going to say that I'm actually worried about that fight. Okay, last time we faced these guys, we took a buttload of damage. Let's not do that this time. Excellent. What we got going on here? Paperclip's tempting. But I have 27 keys. Like, there's only so much point to uh, having a paperclip when you have all the keys you need. And we're not getting, like, Guppy's tail or anything like that, so... Our luck seems to be pretty good, too. I wonder if that's something to do with the, uh, like, sack head or something. Okay, just don't die, that's fine. His mom dies pretty easy. We just got Goathead Baby. And a deal with the devil. Which uh, turns out to be... I mean, I'll take it. The Whore of Babylon. But I don't think we're ever going to get to use it. Unless I mysteriously find a Temperance card or something like that up here. I don't think Curse the Blind is going to cause me too many issues, honestly. What I could really use is a car battery. Can you imagine that? Can you imagine a car battery? I'm gonna pop that real quick while I'm thinking about it. I'm just like thinking the car battery, getting all the familiars and everything like that would be awesome. That looks like that's a curse room, and there's a regular mob trap room up there, which I would totally be willing to do. I'll just take, like, random damage. It's cool. We're not going for Deal the Devil either, either. Why have I fought the exact same room literally, what, four rooms in a row? Okay, just because this room sucks, I'm going to go ahead and uh, pop fun. Okay. That's Steam Sale. As useful as that is right now. One's dead, I believe. Nope. Oh, come on. No reason I should have taken that damage. That's just me sucking. Pill? Tears down. Another one of those down pills that I just don't need right now. Explosive diarrhea. I need to just get out of the way of that. Thank you. I really want to go in that curse room, but it's seeming less and less likely that I'll be able to do so without massive downsides. I really wish I had a uh, battery charge for this room. Thing is, though, like, you know, we're... we're we're beyond the womb. It's boss fights are a lot more likely now, so I don't really have a, like a big way to go. Well, you know, it's a boss fight coming up. I should really charge up for that. No, like it's 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 all boss fights. It's boss fights all the way down. And if I was going to Sheol, that would be okay. That was an actual thing. I should not have been walking into. If I was going to Sheol, that would actually be quite literal. Boss fights all the way down. Occasionally let go to let Gertie do his thing. The good thing about this Gertie uh, minion is that it goes across rocks. It's kind of useful that way. So you can hit most anything. Just gotta charge him up enough. Almost done with this room. 
I'm not sure how much faster it would have been even if I did have uh, a charge going to this room. Faster, sure, but I'm not sure by how much. Uh, that should be a bomb location. Yep. I was kind of hoping for health, I'll be honest. I was kind of hoping for a joker, I'll be honest. I wish I could go into that uh, curse room right now, but I can't without dying. So that's going to have to wait. Still feeling really slow. I will say though, this this uh this run has been pretty enjoyable. Health, please. Is that a downside of Sackhead? Is that you just you're just unlikely to get health? That's kind of what it's feeling like. Tammy's head. Interesting. Not good, but interesting. If we can get ourselves like a Perthro rune or something. Okay, now we have a little bit of protection for our health. I get more. Good. Dead monstro, more health, please. Still that dark room, or that 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 top secret room that's up there. Um, do we pretty good? Oh come on, really, jackass. Oh come on, stop with this nonsense. That lost us kind of all the security that I kind of thought I had. Well, I can see forever, immediately after it's no longer useful. Just gotta be careful with mom. Might as well pop this right now while we wait for her to drop her hand. Two of spades is kinda worthless. Emperor, I would have loved to see that a couple floors ago. Wheel of Fortune, we might, have, might as well take. I don't know what Bob's bladder does. Creepy bombs, it says. Don't think it's worth it. Okay, so the Wheel of Fortune we'll take with us just uh, to get an extra item on the chest. Come on. Do me good stuff. Hanged Man's not good. Hermit's not good. Okay. Should have enough health to go into this room over here. No? Huh. Thought the limit was four. Interesting. So we literally just fought this room, so should not be an issue. Probably gonna be a Hagalaz room if I had to make a guess. Jera, interesting. Well, that's coming with me. Wanna see if we can get some more health? Preferably, please. Really easy to kill the Widow. I think having that uh, Child's Leash has been incredibly helpful for us. Okay, so the next thing we're going to go do is we're going to go do that uh, Mob Trap room real quick. And hopefully get something good out of it. We're going to use the Jera room on the next floor. Uh, yeah, we'll do this. We got an item out of it. We don't know what it is yet, but we got an item out of it. Hopefully it'll be good. Maybe it could be Steven or something like that. That'd be amazing. Cricket's head. Even better. And Guppy's tail. Oh, God. That was a severely good room. Almost wish I had Jared it. Almost. 
Yes, yeah, so I'm gonna do something really silly. And you may be asking yourself, why, Nai? Why are you gonna go do this when you have a fight with uh, Isaac coming up and you have no way to get more health? And you're not wrong, but there is a... Okay, that was really silly damage to take. Come on. Ah, damn. Um, you're not wrong, but there was a... I was hoping that, you know, with two out of three guppy items, um, that that would be something that would turn into something awesome for me. It didn't, which sucks. But there was, like, the hope for it. Okay, I know we got some batteries floating around, so we're going to be able to go grab those. Anything good in this room? I kind of suddenly regret going into this room. Really regret going into this room. Really, really regret going into this room. Okay, well, that was really stupid by me. Um, that's probably going to get me killed. It's going to be my own fault. Haven't seen any tinted rocks in a while, either. There probably have been some that I've just completely missed because I'm, I'm a moron, but... Anything in here? What's these? Hermit. Hanged man. Okay. Most likely what's going to kill me in here is lack of speed. And I get killed by lack of speed. Oh, god damn it, guys. It is, it's my own fault. If I had not gone and fought death, if I had been smart and just left, we would have easily had it. At the very least, we did get the goat head baby. That's a thing. Damn it. Sorry, guys. See you later.